a little bit of a sector type thing. Um, this is Dr. Harlan Borisenko, who is a whole. She is the American, from what I remember reading, she's the American first uh, token whole. Um, and I believe despite being in a marriage and being like a trad thought, like like actual like married woman, she was trying to solicit news from big tech, who I don't think I've ever once spoken about on this podcast. Um, I, I can't I can't put a face to to name, and I can't describe him. I think he's just like a like an a guy who is like American first associated. Um, so these are the zits about it. Let's see. Uh, New Hampshire native 1776 says it seems that the cheating piece of scum that is Dr. Carlin uh, has struck again, this time doing the exact thing she did with you, young guy, uh, Karen J. White, but with Big Tech 404. Below is an overview of how both of these cases share creepy pathological scripted responses. Uh, New Hampshire native says in November 2021, Dr. Carol uh, Carlin, after working on a project with Karina J. White for months, was triggered by him when he disagreed with her stance on open marriage after she told him she was in one with uh, Stryker. The illegal Ukrainian visa overstay, she had a green card married in 2000 or 2011, so she is Ukrainian. I was going to hypothesize that she was because Borosenko is a, or Borosenko is a Ukrainian name. Um, but she moved to the U.S., got a green card. Um, over, I guess she overstayed her visas, if anyone gives a fuck about that in the U.S. <laughs> uh, Dr. Carolyn says, would obsessively insist that conceptual James would sleep with her because her fake psychic Joe Demonio, a.k.a. Psychic Joshua, told her so as part of his 3K month retainer she has on him. This was the same fraud that told Karen and Car Carlin uh, were twin flames. Dr. Carlin would go quiet only to emerge after Dr. Uh, Karen J. White wished her and her husband a happy 10-year anniversary with the now infamous line of enjoy steak. Okay, I'm just going to read these guys' posts. Uh, Carlin would then profess her love for Kieran and would bombard him with messages, message after message after he failed to respond immediately. Now this is Kieran saying, should have thought about this a while ago, just trying to prove they are not doctored. Also, why hasn't she blocked me? Why no counter evidence should be easy? Kieran treated this as a private matter and tried to work things out sensitively over email as he saw the most professional thing to do rather than engage on social media. Fast forward to December 2021, and Carlin has weaponized the article they have co-written, and Karen publicly disavowed her and the article. And this is his statement uh, that she was acting inappropriately. New Hampshire Native says, at this point, this was still a private matter. Um, she does not take kindly to being rejected. She decided to go live exclusively to her local community, many of which bonded with Karen over the last several months he was with them. Um, she is fat. I just want to point that out. And of course, Karen was shocked by the unhinged allegations, unhinged allegations made by her and was forced to expose what had happened and the truth beyond the situation. Well, where does Big Tech's penis come involved in this? I'm, 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 I'm on the edge of my seat. Carlin's narcissism requires her to respond to attacks, so we received another video, this time more aggressive as she realized her lies were exposed. You may not notice the first video, but Carlin admits the DMs are 100% legit and just claims his context is missing. Fast forward to this week. Carlin seems to have cheated on her husband, Stryker, again, this time with Big Tech 404, a content creator she claims or has been claiming is her lowercase i internet boyfriend. How long are these videos? Because I don't mind watching them, actually, if they are short. 36 fucking minutes. Not a chance. An hour and a half. Not a fucking chance. I do want to hear what she sounds like. Because, geez, a little bit scary looking. The underhanded thing to do, but you have to understand that th at this, at the point that I did this, I was already weeks into trying to convince him to calm down over a minor disagreement. 
And it felt like to me that he was trying to sabotage the entire business. He was basically telling me, if you don't do this with me, you're not doing it at all. And I was like, I've tried to give you everything that you want. You are still refusing to participate productively in this. And so, no, no. Okay. I just wanted to get like a, a sound bite of her. What does she sound like? I wanna, now I want to jump in the middle of this one as well and give her like 30 seconds and see if she's unhinged sounding. I may be pushing my computer too far. Opening a video. Playing it. Are you nuts? Are you loony? Insane in the membrane. Mm. At least that's not happening. Yeah, how long what did you do to hurt her? So Ten much? minutes. And I have to listen to this guy in the corner. Okay, well, let's jump to the point. Before you see the rest, she's going to kind of give a big go off, but I'll, t I'll show you exactly, like, literally the last thing I said to her. We're both going to be online. For I just saw a picture of Teddy Fieser jump across his screen at time. random. But there's been a shift. We've had some minor communica uh, communication issues. And with the Groyper situation, I feel like taking a step back. Well, this is not succinct enough. She's not going to apply. In short, Carolyn had been messaging with Big Tech, flirted with him, and asked him for dick pics, asked to sleep with him, possibly sent him nudes. When she decided to go to AFPAC, Big Tech deleted his messages to her because he didn't want Groypers having access to them. She noticed he deleted them. He asked her if she wanted to know how to delete hers too. She said no. He asked her for distance from her. So this happened on Discord, definitely, because otherwise you could just delete the messages. Um, and she decided to attack him in a live stream. He heard about her attack and went on to tell everyone what had happened and that she was full of shit. Carlin in this video telling people that there might be some DMs he could share that wouldn't seem wrong, but they were just harmless flirting and no different than the kind that she does with other Groypers and Nick himself, bro. As if... <laughs> As if Nick Fuentes would be interested in this. Come the fuck on. <laughs> I'm just trying to imagine her trying to flirt flirt with Nick Fuentes. Like <laughs> he would immediately ban her from everything and tell his groypers to like to rape, murder, and die for him. <laughs> <laughs> yeah right I don't know I, I'm, I'm kind of curious what big tech looks like is that big tech on the upper right or is that like a random retard um well I want to see if I can find this real quick I, I'm desperate to know now what big tech looks like where he's like hitting on that fat women and flamboyant gays have similar energy mm. I think that uh, Nick Fuentes is too hates women too much for that. What the fuck is this? big tech? Must be. He was at. He was Ralph's co-host at one point. <laughs> I have no idea who this guy is. He's married though, right? Like for whatever reason in my head, I'm sorry, I'm still trying to find this thread. But it's like in my head, they're, they're he's married. Is that incorrect? Big Heck is the guy who beats his wife. Oh yeah, yeah, that's right. That sounds familiar. This guy. This guy. This guy is trying to hook up with her. Why? So he has a wife that he gets to beat? And he's just like, yeah, I'm going to hook up with, with this really ugly woman. Who's like 40 and still wears eyeliner like she's a uh, June. What the fuck was that picture of her? Sorry, I lost it. Dude, the, 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 
him beating his wife thing. That was that's like a trigger, like a memory trigger. <laughs> I'm trying to remember the details of that. Did you just beat her on stream or something? He beats his kids in life. <laughs> and he f he flirts with like this ugly raper woman. And who's also married. Like what a what a match made in hell for real. Yuck. Gross people chat. Thank you for watching this clip by Colonel J. This is the King of Bold here. Remember to like and subscribe. Juice!